The government says it is determined to stop the destruction of water bodies by illegal miners and chainsaw operators. The Water Resources Works and Housing Minister Alhaji Collins Dauda, who made the pledge in Kumasi, said a big security operation would be launched to clamp down on illegal miners and chainsaw operators. Alhaji Dauda was speaking after touring the Berikesi and Owabi head works of the Ghana Water Company Limited. The purpose of the minister's visit was to assess the state of the two headwicks, which supply pipe-borne water to Kumasi and its environs, and see how best the government can provide the necessary support to boost water supply. The minister was conducted around the production plant and was informed that the current capacity of the Barakesi headwicks is 30 million gallons of water a day. However, it is producing 24 million gallons a day due to frequent power fluctuations. The manager of the Barakesi Headworks, Mr. Opoku Waridako, mentioned illegal chainsaw operations and farming with harmful chemicals in the dam's catchment area as major problems facing the headworks. He said stone quarrying in the area also poses a threat to the safety of the dam. Alhaji Collins Dauda disclosed that a new plant is to be constructed to boost the capacity of the headworks by 6 million gallons a day. At the Owebi Headworks, he learned that the major problem facing water production is siltation. Instead of producing at its maximum of 12 million gallons a day, it can supply only 3 million gallons. Mr. Dauda said there is a proposal under consideration by the government to desilt the dam to enable it produce water at full capacity. Alhaji Dauda had a word for those destroying the country's water bodies. We have a challenge. The challenge regarding the attack of the intake point by Galamsey operators. I'll take this opportunity to appeal to the Galamsey operators to move away from our water bodies. Water is life. And therefore, government will not look on for them to continue attacking our water bodies. The Water Resources Works and Housing Minister and the Ashanti Regional Minister, Mr. Eric Opoku, briefly met the management and key staff of the Ghana Water Company in Kumasi to encourage them to improve upon the water supply system and expose those who are destroying the country's water bodies. Alhaji Collins Dauda also visited the site of the affordable housing project at Asokori Mampong in Kumasi. The housing units, which are at different stages of completion, total 980. Some of the uncompleted housing units have been taken over by squatters. Alhaji Dauda said the government will complete all housing units under the six affordable housing projects cited at Tema, Accra, Komase, Kofodia, Tamale and Wah.